we're standing here in the garden of the painter Henri Le Cidane in the very picturesque medieval village of Gerberoix in Picardy in northern France. We're going to put le, the paintings by Le Cidane in a gallery that we've called Gardens of Silence. He's a French artist who's working at the end of the 19th century and up until his death in 1939. And this garden that he created here at Gerberois was really one of his principal subjects. As you can see, it's a very beautiful garden. And nearly all of the paintings of the garden have no people in them. One subject he returns to frequently is that of the empty dining table in the garden after a meal is over. And he's very interested, like Monet, in exploring different effects of light on the garden. But I think his favorite time of day was the evening at dusk, where he gets this very uh, quiet and very um, sort of meditative and poetic mood. And uh, so I think he fits very well into a part of the exhibition where we're looking at artists who have a sort of symbolist feeling about their work. I think the garden has been uh, kept up uh, by the family. Apparently that the house was requisitioned by German soldiers during the Second World War and the garden really fell into disrepair then. Uh, Le Cidane bought this property in 1904 and immediately began creating the garden. And he was quite influenced by English garden design. He, his work sold well in London. He came to England quite a lot. He visited Kew Gardens and Hampton Court and other gardens in England. Uh, he was particularly fond of the English rose Dorothy Perkins, which we still see growing here. And the family in recent years have restored the garden, I think completely according to Le Cidane's original designs.